probably leaked it already. I was like, let me talk as your mom. You didn't date them. Why are you missing them? Keep that clip. What? Hi, Alison. Do whatever you want. Shut up. She's just mad. Hey, hey guys. I'm Alison. And I'm Lenny. And you're watching Sisters Forever. And today we're doing another mom and I rant where we're going to sit here and rant and answer us questions. Like we always do. So, we have some questions you guys asked. And it's been like, I feel like it's been like a month or two since we answered questions. No, and like three. Three? Mm-hmm. So, it's been a minute. And you guys have lots of questions. So, we're going to get to it. We have a bunch here. So, let's get started. I don't have idea. I just did the screen record, but I don't know what they asked. Which country do you want to visit next? Are we? Or do we answer like... Which country we are going to visit next, or do we want to? It's no. not in the one that we are going to visit. Exactly. Don't okay. say it. Because there's upcoming trips. There's one at the end of May. So in a month, we will be going somewhere with the entire family. When I say entire, I mean like everybody. everybody. Like this. Okay, Coco, you really just want to be. Look at it. Coco, ben, papi. <gasps> it's going to be like 20 of us. So that's, that's exciting. Be so and fun. something is going to happen in that trip. Oh, yeah. Something excited, so stay tuned. Come on! What are you doing? You have to stay tuned in all our channel, okay? Okay. Yeah. I'm just saying, so if you want to be entertained, everywhere. follow You're going to be entertained with us this summer, that's for sure. For sure. It's I don't know how we're going to do it to I know. It. You guys have to be so patient with us. Because we're going to have to balance, like, having fun and then working and, like, when you're and in living places. And enjoying the moment. But it's a lot. To, it's a lot. Plus, Instagram, TikTok, and um, four channels on YouTube. It's a lot. Okay, and you we only do, control two channels. On but YouTube. we do everything ourselves. Yeah. We have a manager, but he doesn't do edition, nothing like that. Yeah. So. Everything. So next country we want to visit. That was a question. We did not answer it. I'm sorry. We're uh, random. I want to go to like Thailand, Bali, Indonesia, Fiji, Maldives. That's a lot of places. But I think my graduation gift next year, next freaking year, guys, I graduate. At this time next year, I'm going to be literally graduating, which is insane. But I want my, because you, you know how you, people do like senior gifts? I don't need anything, but I think you go. God. Yeah, thanks God. I want to go to like the Maldives. Maldives, like Maldives and Fiji trip. is the same thing or no? No, okay. not at all. Sorry. But... Emily is the one to want to go to Fiji, no? No, she wants to go to Bora Bora. It's not the same is... thing? No. You just oh my Fiji. god, so bad with geography. Yeah, you That's were. the only test So we're like I... either Bora Bora or the Maldives I want to go. But you have been checking that it's like 20 something plus yeah, hours. that's the only thing that stopped us is the distance. Nobody wants to be on a plane for 24 hours. I think the money is the same like if you go to Europe three mm -hmm. weeks. It's not about the money, thanks God. It's about the timing. It's so far. You have to put your mind into, oh my God, have to be 24 like, hours okay. in a plane and not in first class. It's not 24 hours in a plane, but it's like 14 and then layover. and then So it's like a huge travel day. 14 is a lot. I know. Guys, we went to Europe last summer and we were on a plane for like eight, nine hours. And, and it was done. Yeah, but like our like our tolerance to travel was really high. Like we were like on it mentally prepared. Because we went to Hawaii, which was five hours and five hours, Awful. like two five hour flights. And then when we went to Europe, we were like we packed ourselves into one suitcase and a backpack. I don't know how we did that for seventeen days. For yeah, like twenty days. No idea. And we went. We literally like we went an eight hour flight, two days in Paris. Literally 7 a.m. flight and not. No, I'm packing. I'm unpacking every two days. I don't three know days. how we did it. And we didn't fight. We did not. But that was that. No, but when we got to Spain, Emily and you were done. Because also, like, we didn't really want to be in Spain. There was not much to so do. So I don't know. Which now looking back, there is stuff to do. We were just so like done, drained. Done. But anyways, so guys, we have to go back to Spain. Why not? <laughs> Anyways, what I was just saying, oh, our tolerance to travel was really high. Like, we could do anything, and we could do it. But now, No, but I remember, we went low. to Paris, then we went to... Naples, which we went to Positano. Positano, but after that, we were so tired because that place just stares. Oh, yeah. So, thanks God, after that was Greece, and, Greece and was all the energy so went peaceful. up, like... 100% yes. but we got to but Greece, then we didn't like, want to leave that was the issue that we didn't want to leave and then we had to go to Malaga which 
My dad wanted to go to Malaga, and it was fun, but it's just like it no. Was but you didn't much, do anything there. We didn't do anything. You remember that we went to a spa, but we couldn't record. But oh, it was we did fun. Go to a spa. You forgot yeah. that. I know I did. Mm -hmm. But anyways, pretty much now our travel tolerance is very low. Like We're there. our one-hour flight to the Grand Cayman. Oh my gosh, that was, that was an eternity. I just we got there. Yeah. Oh, that one was quick. But when we went to Aruba, that felt so long. No, but it was listen, three hours. Listen to me. Before. Going to Miami for three hours is like you mentioned my mother to me. I hate to go to Miami in you a ride. Your mother? Like, me cago en tu madre. Oh, that's okay, not I what you I'm, just said. What I said. It's like you mentioned your mother to me and you said, I hate, like if you hate your mother. No, 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 no. Cuando alguien me decía de ir a Miami, yo decía, me cago en tu madre porque yo no quiero. Yo día va a ir a Miami en un carro. Okay, well, that's just like not what you just said. Bueno, can you say in English? I don't know what cago en tu madre is. <laughs> <laughs> like, eh, I, me cago en tu <laughs> okay, she's wait it. I shit, hate shit on your mom. Uh huh. But like that's just not. That's like, in Spanish. Yeah. I don't know how you say. She's saying. not saying she hates her mother. She loves her no. mother. No. That's not what she tried to say. It's something in Spanish. You know my English is very good looking. So the point is, she now, wanted to go to Miami. Awful. But now we have to go so much because that's where all of our planes, like flights, are from. So then now it's like we're, we're going, going down for the street. a concert for one day. Yeah. Years before, no honey boo boo. Yeah. So like and now, now it's like. We have to get back adjusted for the summer because summer is going to be pretty hectic. Don't, don't, don't stress but me already. But our tolerance right now is pretty low, I feel like. No, also when you see all the clips, the memories, the photo, we are so grateful. I know, it's insane. It's amazing. Maybe when you are in the moment, you don't appreciate it as much as you do after. Yeah. So next question. If you ever stop doing YouTube, what job would you do? Like if you... Well, you probably would just Social stop media. retired, but like, if you got to restart and get an education and everything, like, what would you do? Social media. Okay, but like, <laughs> no. That's what I like, photos, editing, that kind of things. For now, maybe in a few years, I think differently, but right now, that's what I enjoy. I can do it for free, so. You don't have to get angry. That's what I enjoy. Because I have pride. Oh my God. <laughs> Anyways, I would do real estate and interior designing stuff like that, which I still plan to do because obviously I'm not out of high school yet. But that's what I plan to do alongside YouTube. Like I want to travel, and then once I'm home and like settle down, I want to like integrate YouTube. Like I'm literally gonna have like a TV show, Allison remodels homes. Like you know, like keep that clip. And Matt, you know, like those people that do like it's like on. And you have the perfect couple for that. You know, they texted me, he texted me yesterday and was like, if you ever need me to build anything, I'll build it. And I, I was like, perfect. I know that's going to be, I'm just saying. I know. The future is bright. <laughs> Anyways, uh, back to what I was saying. Um, You know those people that have like those like shows, shows on TV? TLC. And then, like, yes, and then like they get a house and they remodel it. Like that is a dream. I think I should do that. I think I, I should do that. I think you are that. very good. Once I travel, because I want to like travel first. Because I love traveling, I love planning, as you guys know. I'm a very yeah, I awesome planner. You can travel like for one month. The other three months that you are at home, you need content. Why don't flipping houses? No, I'm going to do that because I'm getting a Well, this is what we plan to do. I want to get a house during my senior year um, and remodel it so that once I'm out traveling. With all her ideas. Rafael yes. and me, we're going to. Yes. Well, me. My dad Shh. and them are just going to put their name on the house because I technically not buy a house until I do like two years of taxes, taxes or whatever. It's but she has to pay and all yeah. of that. It's like, I'm already getting paid, but like, pretty much I'm going to find she a house. She has a job. I have a job, guys. This is long. Since you're seven years old. Oh my gosh. Nobody wants to believe me. I'm like, oh my gosh. Who cares? Anyways, I want to get a house, flip it, so that when I'm traveling, I have some source of income alongside social media, but, like, I want to have some source of income. You're going to start with one, but you're going to yeah. have more. and then, like, the goal is to have, like, Dios a good amount, and Airbnb, and, like, like renting alongside Airbnb. Oh, so you cannot put all your eggs in one yes. basket. I love social because media. Because you never know what can happen but with social media. But I want to collaborate both of them. Like, I want to do, it's like... possible. Home or mall, and if I want to like end up doing real estate and like go out and sell houses like that, I'll probably do possible. it as well. But the goal is to get one, remodel it during my senior year because I'm going to be can doing, be a series on yes, this Miali. I'm going to be doing um college at my community college for like my senior year. So oh, your daddy, when we went to your game yesterday, she, he said, "Oh, next year she's gonna play as a, if she doesn't come to the school." No, can you, can you still, play? You can still play because oh, okay. I'm gonna be enrolled. At my high school as a student, but I won't be taking classes mm. at the school. But you can do a sport. So yeah, I'll still be doing like weightlifting and maybe flag football. But 
pretty much I want to do that during my senior year because I'm only going to probably have classes maybe two, three times a week for three hours. Like, I'm going to have tons of time and I want to put that into something. Manager so... is texting. Okay, let me tell you something. Remember what you are answering today so you don't answer the same thing on Ismi Ali tomorrow. <laughs> Okay, next question. Anyway, She's gonna do everything in life. So. Yeah, so probably real estate. Next question. Does it ever bother you that the supporters are getting involved in your personal life? Yes. But I wouldn't say, like, I feel like our supporters and our fans, like, yes, they're curious, but there's the a Daniel difference me. than the haters. people who are just way nosy. Like, there's just a difference. Because I have no idea how they found that photo of us at prom. Because I don't even know where it is. Like, you truly, like, I was thinking about it this week, and I was like, like, how does that, like, like, I don't know. Like, I don't uh, understand how wait, they have... Wait, explain behind. Okay, so pretty much, I wake up on Saturday, Sunday morning, literally went to bed at 5.30, at 10 a.m., I'm getting a call from my mom. It was prom weekend. Yes, and she's like, oh, they leaked it already. I was like, what? She was like, yeah, you guys had a party. I'm like, what party? Like, I'm like, when did I, like, what party are you talking about? She was talking about prom. So there's a picture that literally, like, our assistant principal took this picture of us at prom and it's like getting Who is us? me and the kid I went to prom with. Um, <laughs> see, like I wasn't trying to get this out so soon, but it just like, well, I woke up one morning. And oh, one more knew. thing. People say, oh my God, I just don't have been in so many relationships. Let me Guys, talk. Wait. Let me talk as your mom. Okay. Shut up. Okay. You don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> she has three boyfriends. And he's not one behind the other one for one day, the next day, no. She has spent month, even a year, with her previous relationship. She took a break. Maybe because you don't see every single block, we don't block everything. That doesn't mean that she left one, she got the other. It's not like that. But you, you see it like that, but it's not like that. Also, she's a teenager. She can have multiple boyfriends before she find the one. And just let her be. Oh my goodness, we are Retweet. their parents and we know who she is and she's very good girl. She's not like that. Maybe you see her like also, that, but she's not like that. I want to just like, okay, wait, what was the question? Personal life. Okay, yeah, anyways, I was posted everywhere. I woke up to it and it's not she like I was know. upset. No, I was sleeping. Emily was at her friend's house. She sent me the TikTok and she said, oh my God, it's out. And I yeah. thought you knew, but you were no, sleeping like for two hours after yeah, that. Yeah, she called me. She's like, "Are you awake?" I was like, "No." She's you like, saw what happened? No. Yeah. So, um, that happened. And about my personal life, it's just like to an extent, like you really had to dig to find that picture. And like, I don't. Sometimes I don't understand like how somebody's entire life could be my life. Cause it's like my life, like I'm living it. No, and, and they say it just your does picture, not your videos in me. their phone, so they can. Yeah, like. They're Maybe really like digging to find every little piece of information to turn it and twist it and make me look this way or that oh, way. Also, they look like, like it's in one clip, 15 second clip, but they put clips that have been in three years, four yeah. years. And that's looks what, like another thing one I day. don't understand. Like, people don't think that people change. Like, there's still clips of me from like five years ago or whatnot. Like, yes, I've been on social media since I was seven years old and I'm not the same person I was at seven years old. That's obvious. I'm 17, that was 10 years ago. Like, and you won't be the same person in two it's, years. Yeah, like it's just different. And like I'm obviously gonna change and I'm gonna mature, but people just think I'm still But you change your point of view body. of putting your relationship out. What yes, do you think and I right didn't now? Want to put my relationship out so soon, but no, it even we talked that never put her out. I wasn't gonna put it out ever. It's my relationship. I don't need you. She guys wants in to it. take care really well of this. And like people just think that, oh i'm a teenager and like the thing is like i'm a teenager i go to high school i go to public high school like i see what teenagers are doing and then when i get hate for it online and i compare myself to what like everybody else is doing and i'm not saying i'm perfect because i'm far from perfect but like when i compare myself to the like my life to the life of the people around me She's where, what they do every single weekend is like absurd and i would never do that in a million years i'm like but you are out there but I'm the public it. eye where everything I do is judged and everybody thinks they have like a, the right to state their opinion, which they do, go ahead. But like when I compare it, I'm just like, oh my gosh, like You're there's actually no way. Because like, guys, I literally, like I don't know how to explain it. 
but it's not my business. Or but uh, business. what I always said to Alison, your mom, your dad, my mom, she's so supportive of Alison. She my talked grandma. with Alison. <gasps> we know who she is, and I said, Alison, don't care about what people say, but that's not in my control. She sometimes she get affected by that. I, it's not that much. When I posted, whenever that happened, see this is blurry. When everything got posted, I was like, whatever. So I how did you feel own. that day? That day I was just like, I wasn't surprised. Like I knew at one point or another it was gonna come out, but like I'm happy it came out when it did. But I was just kind of like, bro, because I don't even know how you guys find that picture. Like in all seriousness, where did that come from? No idea. Like let me know because it was it a Facebook page like. I didn't even go looking for it. I don't you know don't have Facebook. Yeah, I don't. Like, I don't know how these people searched and found I'm the one who controls Sister Forever Facebook, and we didn't post anything. Oh, even, we don't have that picture in our... I don't have it. Like, I really don't have it. I always say, Alison, you don't have to hide anything. You are free. He's free. Nobody... I don't are involved. I'm not going to be posting. If you guys think, oh, this is going to be another part three or whatever, four. No. So, it's gonna be like here and there. but this is my relationship and I would hope you respect that I want to keep things private because people just have so much to say and it's just not necessary and I don't want that again. It's fine. And what's in the past is in the past. Let's leave it in the past. Everybody has moved on. Everybody's Everybody. happy. So you guys can move on as well because if people are like, oh, we missed so-and-so, oh, we missed so-and-so. You didn't date them. Why are you missing them? Like, I don't, that one I don't understand quite, but it's fine. Anyways, to answer the question, do you ever get bothered when people are in, like, involved in your personal life? And think I don't care what people rights? say about me. I care when they talk about my daughters. Yeah, Other than I, don't, that, I, don't I care. typically don't let it affect me because I'm like, And if they're happy. fine, I don't care, but sometimes maybe they don't express all their feeling to me, so I don't know if they're fine or not. No, yeah, I'm, I'm okay with the situation now. The day of, we're like... Previously, like when the freaking <laughs> I put him in a clip for like literally two seconds in my spring break vlog. Oh, explain that. Literally two seconds, guys. Like literally, not even. No, a no, I'm not talking about that. I'm not talking about that. They say that you were dating the brother twins. That was a oh lie. Oh my gosh. I my friends Danica and Daniela. They thought I was dating their brother. And they I, say that. I don't I'm know who is their brother. brother. I met him. We made a joke out of it. Oh, you're my boyfriend. No. That's not my boyfriend. They were trying guys. to find your boyfriend. Everybody was searching high and low for this guy. And, like, I don't think it's that serious. Let me be. I'm a teenager. I'm going to date people. I'm going to like people. That's just how it is. And everybody, you, and who, you, you I, are watching this. You are doing the same thing. So shut up. Okay. <laughs> no, I'm Let's not. move on. <laughs> it's so easy to talk about other people's life. Look yourself. Look your life. So shut up. No, because it's annoying. They think, oh my god, they're inside a room commenting like they have the perfect life. That's what I don't, I've never like commented on another person's post and like stated my opinion. Like, yes, I can have an opinion, but like to Me vocalize neither. it to where it could possibly hurt somebody, like just don't. Like, I seriously just don't really understand that one. But anyways, next one. We are spending like 40 minutes in two questions. I know, we've only answered two questions. <laughs> but to answer your guys' question, Yes, it kind of does bother me, but I understand that my life is in the public eye, so I don't really have, like... Control. Control over it, but I'm trying to keep this private, and I want to keep it private because I want to protect it. So if you guys could not search for every little piece of information, I'll give you guys glimpses here and there. Oh, but this me, is Ali. my life, okay? And yes, I put a lot of it out there, but there doesn't mean everything needs to be out there. So, anyways. Let her be. To answer the question... Yes, but I understand. Anyways, is Emily going to be posting more or is she going to get her own camera? Like, stuff like that for Emily G. I hope she does. She's currently editing a video. Keep She's knowing that Alison and me, I think we're passionate about this. Emily, I don't think she's in that point yet. I think it takes a while because at her age, I wasn't still passionate about That's it. Right. Like. I would post here and there, but like all my videos, my mom would edit for It's Me Ali. So it took me a while. It literally was like... And your channel is growing yeah. so much. I this, know. This month, 10,000 subscribers. Yeah, it's been crazy, but it's been so much fun to, like, film and edit stuff. I so, love like, them, I hope one day Emily, like, gets into it, gets into it. But it's okay but if she doesn't do it. it takes time. But even though, maybe not everybody's passionate about the same thing. Maybe she has passion about another thing. She wants to be a cheerleader coach. Oh, she does? Yes. So, everybody's different. But she's in there. She's, she's getting there. She's still young. 
Would you let your daughter's friend stay over at your house if they got kicked out of theirs? Yeah. Do you understand the question? Yeah, but who friend? Depending on your friend. If I know that... Like why they got kicked out of their house? Maddie can stay. But other guy, not that. I don't know what they did. Well, le okay. Let's just say their parents are just abusive and they left. Oh, yes. If I, don't, if I don't get in trouble because of that, yes. Yeah. But like if they got kicked out of their house because they were like doing drugs, would you let them stay here? I don't know. I don't know. Mm -hmm. okay. I don't my, know. my friends don't do drugs. so I, think I don't know. <laughs> we don't do drugs, so I'm not agree with that. Does your mom want another baby? No. We had like, easy. didn't we have like a pregnancy scare a couple of years ago? Yeah. We were in the apartments? No, I just fake it for views. Oh. <laughs> I, I, was, we were I was with a bit far inside me and I just posed like this and I did the screenshot and got you so many... You already got makeup on your sweatshirt. I know because of the straw. It was a clip babe, but no, I don't want more babies. And I'm ready to be a grandma, but no, to have another shot. Oh, I'm ready no, to be a grandma. You're still thirty. Rafael and me talk about that, and we are so happy when that day comes. Oh yeah, but you're still thirty. Well, it's not like I want it tomorrow. No, yeah, but no, she's not thirty. She's thirty-six. Seven. Seven. Not thirty, but, but she's I in look her so young, guys. Um, what's Emily's dream car? It's literally like a Porsche, a pink Porsche. Do you imagine? A million dollar baby. Oh, no. guys, that's no. what happened today. No, don't say it. Stay tuned in the blog. Next question. Oh, yeah. Another yeah. accident. <laughs> Not a question, but please convince Maddie to make a channel. It's in the works. She's it's working it. on it. Uh, any tips on your first quote unquote boyfriend? Mine? No, like you. tips for somebody who has their first boyfriend. I be yourself. Don't let that he control you. Um, yeah, have your own like opinions and stay true to them. Or not even opinions, just have your own like personality. Like, well, like what's it? What's no, that some word? people change depending on the guy they are dating. Standards. Have your standards and Very stay high. with them. Because like, if you let them, like, oh, one thing slide, one thing slide, it's just they won't change, guys. They don't change. But you have to kiss a lot of frog before you have your princess. It's like that. <laughs> What are you trying to say? Que tú tienes que besar mucho sapo antes que llegue el príncipe. ¿Cómo se dice eso? Um, you have to kiss a lot of frogs before you meet your prince. Uh -huh. Yes, that. I guess. In Spanish, you say like that. I don't know why English don't have those things. How is Ali able to balance schoolwork, having fun without being stressed? I don't have any schoolwork literally ever. <laughs> like, I think I did homework for the first time this whole year, like last week. I don't know how, because I don't even have that easy of classes, but like I just don't. You are so smart, so. I don't have, I don't have homework. I don't, all, but I also don't take like AP classes. Do you feel stressed? Mm -mm. Oh my I mean, God, I feel so much stress all the time. I don't. Not oh really. I mean like I do, but like I, I just write Wait it down until in my to-do list. Wait until you are 37. Okay. <laughs> I just write it on my to-do list, and then I hate when my to-do list gets too long though. So then I have to do everything. You don't feel satisfaction when you check. Oh, I, yeah, dog, I have like a to-do, I make a to-do list like every single day. And like whenever I'm going to go film a video, like I have a to-do list for the video. I like to be organized. I don't, I'm not stressed, but I usually just manage it pretty well. I have a lot going on. Like I have school. That and I she loves it. She hates to, to I love be it. without doing Yeah, and that's why so. I'm like, like I could totally, oh, my dad's calling. Hola. Hey. I'm great. I just have this really bad back ache and my neck's like broken. Yeah. It's oh my god. Yeah, it's like really bad. You gotta be fucking kidding. <laughs> I'm not kidding. Yes, you are. I know I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> oh, how do I balance everything? Yeah. To-do list. I love making to-do lists. Like, I just need to make a to-do list, like, every single day. That's one tip. And then I have, like, school, sports, filming, editing, my you social life. You teach me life. so much in life that you don't even know. No, I know. Uh, it's true because everything that you put your mind to, you do it. We were talking about that yesterday when we were we watching your game. I said... How she's playing flight football. I don't she's know how said it. She's playing. Football. She's doing amazing. I did not think I could. Sometimes also. And I was just thrown into I it. I was talking with my friend Yomara yesterday. And one thing that I told her is. I was so ñoña. Like so like. Oh my god. I have a pain. Oh. So people oh. can say. Oh I'm sorry. Yeah. 
and you teach me that sometimes you are in so much pain and you don't complain? And I said, huh? Me? Alison, we were in Cayman Island. Oh, I have been with a lot of pain in my... Listen to uh, and you don't ask for a pill, you don't say oh. anything, you hit her and you don't complain. I'm like dying and you just won't know. You, you <laughs> don't know and I say, oh my God, and I just have a, Achi! oh my God, I miss it. And I say, she <laughs> teach me to be a stronger every day because... Nobody t- cares, you just have to push them. I know, but before I thought everybody cares about what I'm doing. You feeling. just want to like people to reassure exactly. you that it's okay. That's a problem that I have. I, you, you like but now pity. I don't. Huh? You like pity, like you like when people pity you. No people. My husband, my mom. <laughs> no, sometimes you gotta be like, oh, I'm Exactly, her. but you teach me to be a stronger. That's good. It's a change the question because I'm gonna cry. <laughs> no. Yes. Let's stay on this question. Anyways, I don't know how I balance it. I just do. And I don't, I, like, honestly, if you think about it, like, I do a lot. But, like, I don't know how I do it. I also get home from school early, so I have, like, a lot of time to do stuff. I don't know. I just figure it out. Mm-hmm. She's very organized in that aspect. So, I think this beat is gonna be so long, but people like to hear us, no? <laughs> you are absolutely the prettiest mom ever, and I hope you are better now because of the ocean. Do you have a scar? No. Uh, it's a record. Oh, uh, not really. I'm uh, fine. She almost died on my 17th birthday. Lean here. <laughs> yeah, it was just scary. But that day, you even say it in one clip. Oh, you are not like... Yeah, she was good. She was because good. I was because, in shock for no, real. Yeah, it was like kind of traumatic. So we were in these huge waves and it was so much fun. We were okay, they weren't even huge waves. We were just right at the break where like everything crashes, which was not really Where'd smart of us. Be? But they were decently sized, yeah. But anyways, my mom got taken under and got she dragged. And then she got dragged again and then she got dragged again until she had to get pulled out. I of didn't the water. know that the guy that was trying to help me, he fell. The wave took him. I got that clip from the GoPro, you were really? filming. I haven't watched the video. Oh, well, the guy, and he went back out, and he was trying to help me, and between Rafaela and him, they took me out. Because yeah, I couldn't so do it by myself. She got dragged. You know, some memories, I saw like three or four comments. Oh my God, you are so dramatic. You didn't, you did, you did not. That's her being calm. That was calm. That, that was, so was real. Calm. That was any a, a, other situation, a, she would have been, I think she was like so in shock that she literally like couldn't even be dramatic. Because sometimes you just dramatic, can I sing? For the, the views. views. No. But this, not for the views, because I like, I'm Latina. We she are dramatic. She doesn't be dramatic. But that day, it was serious. I and was then, like, no, at one point, what, when the wave came and wet all our cameras, all our towels. I was like, we're done. At that point, we were full of sand. I have sand in my ear, in my hair for more than a week. Yes, I and I was like this, and I, I remember feeling like, looking at everybody, and I said, what are we gonna do? Who's <laughs> gonna she help didn't do us? anything to help? No, but I was like, I don't know what to do because I just need a shower to take all that sand and to clean all the towels and we couldn't and I was like, and she came to me and she said, oh my God, you're so, just, do you use one word that I don't know? She, calm? No, it wasn't calm, but I don't know. You, and I asked you, what is that? You said, oh, you are not being dramatic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it was pretty bad, honestly. I expected worse from her. And that night, the pain on my neck, it was awful because the first thing that I felt, it was the wave back here in my back. And my she back like, cracked <laughs> like this. And my neck, oh my God. Yeah. She really, I love taking them on adventures. Because whenever I... No, I cannot YOLO, guys. She's not YOLO. I'm not a YOLO. That's the one time she tried to be YOLO and she like literally... I remember, died. I was outside. I don't want to swim, but I was trying to pee. And I went with Alexis and I said, Alexis, grab my phone here. Let me go inside and just pee and film while I go inside. But, I went, but when I went inside, I said, okay, I have my daughter, my husband. Well, we are here in Cayman Island. Let me enjoy two minutes with them. And I started like, woo, woo, with a wave. Five times. Woof. <laughs> almost died. You see, I cannot jolo. That's so funny. But look, I've taken you guys on like the most crazy adventures. I know. If it's for me, I just go to a hotel, sit in the pool. And, and literally just drink it. at the bar. But she's so adventurous. Like thanks God. Hawaii, that was an adventure. Oh my God. That was, God, you guys so have to watch those vlogs because 
I remember just pissing myself, not literally pissing myself, but like laughing so hard in the back seat because we I like was a, so mad a that three day. mile dirt road and it was like <laughs> with no Wi-Fi, no internet. It was so fun. And it was to watch the sunset and we have two minutes. But it was to you, watch. you can't even lie, that has got to be the coolest beach we've ever been to. It was like a dream. You felt you like you a tiny there. people in a huge world. It was huge. We had this it was huge mountains, it, huge waves. In camera. It was so You won't surreal. feel what we you felt You can camp that there. So I'm literally, when I graduate high school, I'm going to go camp there. Call me? That's the next question. Oh. If Allison leaves the country, will you fall, will the family follow her? Is Not she so much the country, but like if Allison goes out and travels. My I want dad to. I don't have nothing Emily to do. Are convinced that they're gonna do it. They're like, you have to wait one year, and then Emily's well, gonna, gonna go, go online, and that you guys. I'm gonna go. <laughs> you guys go on a couple of them, but not every single place I go. Because you wanna be with your boyfriend. No, I just wanna go with my friends. <laughs> what friend? I'm gonna meet people. I know it's coming. <laughs> it's coming. I'm that people. No, mom, because she's a baby. And when I'm not a baby, I die. Exactly, I can't have people with people who are just dying on me. <laughs> and like the body of the phone. <laughs> I'm dying. <laughs> what? Okay, next one. Anyways, question. they want to follow me. Emily's like, you have to wait one year. Comment down below if you I'm think we can travel classes. as a family. Yes, we can travel as a family, but I also want to travel alone. Hi, Alison, do whatever you want. Shut up. I'm going to. Mm -hmm. She's just mad. Yes. She's mad. But yeah, I have so many places I want to go. And some of them are going to be with... She's going to come back to us. Go. Don't you worry. I'm obviously going to come back. How was prom? So much fun. My video was actually just posted 30 minutes ago. I'm excited to watch. I'm going to link this one here because that's all the recopilation of the whole weekend with party and boom, boom, boom. Yeah, I'm gonna go post about it right no, now. No, Alisa is gonna finish the Give me one The camera second. is gonna die. Give me one. Can you do I that after? I just changed the battery. Excuse me? No, you change it again because after you change it, you talk for 20 minutes. Oh, oops, sorry. <laughs> okay, let me... Guys, Alison can talk for hours. We only put like 20 to 30 minutes in the vlog, but normally it's like an hour long vlog. Do you like long blocks or short blocks? Let me know because this one maybe can be super long. Alison, you can do that later. Give me literally one. Two second. more questions. I have to go and pick up Emily. You know what I did yesterday, guys? Yeah, tell them about your little story. Well, now every Wednesday, Emily wants to go to church and she leaves school with her friend. I didn't know that yesterday was I Wednesday. Knew it. I was out And she gym. didn't remind me, so I wait in line for 50 minutes. It and when so I got in front of the school, I unlocked the car and I was waiting for her and I said, oh my God, she won't come. It's Wednesday. I was so mad. So I went back home without I Emily. knew it when I Why was... Why you didn't tell no, me? Last Wednesday you told me. I know. I remember. But I was like, isn't it Wednesday? And you were already gone. But you gone. were in the garage. Yeah, you were already gone. Oh um, my... Why you didn't like, text me? I live, I can't leave the line. It was so funny. Like 50 I minutes in I line. I literally was like crying. Oh, you knew before I told you? Yeah, I knew it. And I was Emily like, sent me like, like 20 texts. I'm so sorry, sorry. Emily, you have to remind me. You know my memory. That's so funny. No, that's not funny. I waste so it much time. It's actually the funniest thing ever. You are making time. No, I'm not. <laughs> you are making time, so stop it. Guys, I'm. this might be a little bit like self-centered. I saw that that you said in one blog that I, I don't edit. I literally just watch my own videos. Maybe it's because I just love the way I edit them and like it just looks so fun. I'm like obsessed with my own life and then I realize like that's literally my life. <laughs> like I'll dead seriously, I've watched my spring break vlog at least 10 times because you like your job and it's you enjoy so, your I think job they're so interesting so yeah um uh, i watch my own videos is that weird i don't know a lot um, of people are gonna say that's weird but guys i just like i think they're so entertaining are you scared for emily driving and giving her that freedom because i feel like with me it was never like a qu i feel like did you even question it with me because i was always just doing stuff with emily it's like she doesn't do anything so the second you give her freedom like what is she gonna do with me, it was different because I've always just, I've just had my freedom because I've just done it without. I'm as scared, really yeah. Asking. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How scared? Why are you laughing? Oh my god, because 
I don't know, she has to practice in my big car. And yeah, it's she's not scared. a thing. It's not a Tesla, it's not tiny. And it's so huge. And I don't know where and how she's gonna practice more so I can have enough confidence so she can go out by herself. My Jeep is pretty nice. But she never drive your Jeep. Yeah, because I don't want to. And Thompson. Um, this last and final question, we're gonna end, like finish it off. What would you do if Allison crashed her car again? Wash in a few blocks. Bye. We'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.